Finally off that damn airplane. Hello officer, how are you doing? Okay, I guess they, they, they don't want to talk to anybody. Okay, so first things first. I'm gonna call a cab. And... I'm gonna buy my first car with the money I the money I saved up throughout high school. Why is my cab so far away? I don't understand that. Where to, friend? Please drive me to the um the, the nearest car dealership. Thank you. Here we are. Okay, so apparently this is the only car dealership. In in LA. Don't know why, but oh well. Check out my new ride. Not bad for now. Okay. Okay, so whew, life, huh? One day I'm in High school in New York. Now I'm going to college in UCLA. So um, I just got done speaking with an agent, someone who sells houses, and we found a ha a house that I could afford so right now we are going to go check out the house so according to my GPS this is the house hmm. not bad I mean it's a little f far away from the city, but it it will have to do for now. Let's go check out the inside.
Okay, I better hit the sack. We got a big game tomorrow. UCLA is gonna kick some butt, baby. Let's do it. Man, is it morning already? I better hurry up and go. Let's see how fast this guy is. Movie Grandma. Oh yeah, but oh my, you can make it. Welcome everyone to an exciting broadcast of college basketball here on 2K Sports. Some great action in store tonight, seeing some of the best and brightest young players on the hardwood. Along with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg, this is Kevin Harlan. We've got the Kansas Jayhawks facing the UCLA Bruins. And, and guys, th there's just nothing quite like a packed house for a college hoop game. You hear the student section rocking and the band playing. This is, is pure basketball. Greg, there's a unique energy and vibrancy with college basketball that is unique. I mean, when you get two high-profile teams meeting up with future stars making a name for themselves, I think it just adds to the excitement. So let's take a look at the starters for the Kansas Jayhawks. They've got Duncan, and it's Gaines in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. And you see a lot of players who are very talented play with a me-first approach. That is not the case with Freak. He doesn't try and attract any unnecessary attention and just focuses on playing his game. Yeah, I like that about him, Greg. I mean, in a day and age where most guys are self-centered and it's all about me, it's refreshing for a player like Freak who doesn't invite that kind of noise. I mean, that's as impressive as a skill set. Here's Roberts. Campbell kicks to Freak. There's the pass to Looney. Stolen by Terry. Lee passes to Terry. Can't connect from short range. That's terrific defense right there to prevent from converting in close. And Kansas always seems to be in title contention. I mean, the program does a great job of finding tough players and having a system that fits them best. Rarely are they not a title contender. Here's Fresh. Clock at six. Now here's Freak. D right on him. Can't hit. And Kansas the other way now. That's not a sight you see very often. I mean, 
He has a great feel for that jump shot, especially when he's open. Now Gaines. The shot no good. Oh, you, you've got to be able to deliver when you get a bunny like that. That's just too easy of a shot to miss. The inside. There's a screen. The dish to Gaines. Terry against Campbell. Looking to end the drought. Shot by Terry, no good. And, and although not a block officially, it, it might as well have been his ability to uh, react and, and alter the shot. Greg, I don't think there was any doubt about it. His defense threw him off on that shot. Now here's Freak. Pass to Looney. Some nice ball movement by the Bruins. Fresh. And he wills that one in. Sinking right through off the back iron. And that's definitely a shot that he has in his arsenal. Platoon swap here for Kansas. Kansas trails by four. And so in the game for the Jayhawks, we've got Williams. And it's Frazier in at the five down low. Daniels kicks to Williams. On the wing, Daniels. Six to shoot. Pass to Calderon. The Jayhawks need to get off a shot here. And count it. The shot is good. He'll go to the free throw line. Yeah, how about that one? Able to maintain control and finish the play. Yeah, we call that playing through the whistle. You know, he didn't give up on it when he heard the whistle. He kept his focus, his concentration, and he found a way to get the shot up and down. The Jayhawks shooting their first free throw of the game right now. Free throw good. Frazier. Here's Free. The feed now to Freak. Thomas a screen. Thomas sets a screen for Freak. He dishes it to Morris. So he gets the whistle. Contact on the way up and two shots coming up. And guys, so many great players from UCLA in the NBA over the years. Kareem, a former Bruin. Bill Wong also coming out of Westwood. Wow, Greg, all those great players you uh, mentioned with UCLA, a lot of Hall of Famers in that list, Clark. Yeah, and they've continued that tradition with current NBA stars, Kevin. Kevin Love and Russell Westbrook, probably the two highest profile former Bruins in the NBA today. Well, one thing about Kansas is that they love their basketball. Jayhawks have long been synonymous with being a powerhouse college program. One of the true blue bloods, if you will, in college basketball. I mean, they've been relevant and in contention for a very long time. They were winning titles before any official organization was put in place. A nice shot by Frazier. The Bruins making a switch here. Martin has checked in. And you said it. I mean, the Jayhawks have won for a really long time. Three college titles for them. The first one coming in 1952, the others in 88 and 2008. You know, so often we Move can forget ball. that these players Stick are student much. athletes. I mean, Freak does not have that problem. He's an amazing student off the floor and is very dedicated in the classroom. And how about Freak with a 4.0 GPA, an honor student in high school, and has carried that same work ethic to college as well as he prepares for his games. He truly embodies what it means to be a student athlete. Here is Daniels following the basket by Freak. And yes, sir, that one drops. It's guys, so often big state schools like Kansas care more about football than basketball, but not the case with the Jayhawks. I mean, the basketball program has been a source of pride for a long time, and when you have success like they've had, it's really easy to be proud. Yeah, good job to take it right at the deal. Yeah, really left him no choice there, Greg. He had the foul and keep him from converting the easy bucket. Looney's checked in for UCLA. Campbell comes in for Morris. No good on the second free throw. 
52 seconds left in the first half of the game. Lee kicks it to Gaines. And he didn't get quite enough under that one. I didn't see that miss coming. I mean, he's usually been money from that range. Campbell shots good. Clearly, he's one of the best there is in the business when it comes to making that lead pass. Kansas trails by three. Lee kicks to Jenkins. Eight second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Dishes it to Gaines. Passes it to Barnes. Six to shoot. He feeds it to Lee. And here we go. Three heading to the hoop. Here's Barton. Can't get it to go. Good D by Lee. And this is why you need good defenders on the interior to contest shots. Yeah, Greg, making every shot a hard one, even the shots in close. And so it's a close game as we wrap up the first half of basketball. The Bruins on top. They're up by three. And we'll be back shortly for the start of the second half. More college basketball coming right up. And the second half of basketball is about to get underway, folks. Welcome back to this broadcast of college basketball here on 2K Sports. Guys, we had a tight game through the first half. I think we'll see more of the same coming out of the break. And it's just going to take one big run for one of these teams to establish control. If Freak can get hot, his team has a great chance of coming away with the victory. Freak in at point guard. Campbell is out there with Looney. Then it's Fresh, and it's Roberts in at the five. There's the pick. Duncan high post. <laughs> And fouled hard that time. He'll get to the line and shoot two. Yeah, the defender all over. Greg, he got him good there. I mean, that's why the shot was so far off. This is his first trip to the line tonight. And that one misses. And that trip coming up empty. Missing both. Hard to watch UCLA and not think of... The Wizard of Westwood, John Wood, not just his impact on the school, but his place in the history of basketball. He helped put college basketball on the map in a big way. And so in the game for the Jayhawks, we've got Oubre, and it's Duncan in at the two. Kansas trails by three. Lee kicks to Duncan. Oubre with it, looking for his first basket still on this one. The drive by Lee. The layup missed. The legendary John Wooden was the coach at UCLA from 1948 until 1975. And Greg, he built his program from obscurity into one of the most storied programs in the country. Yeah, I mean, he was a fantastic coach, arguably the, the best of all time, and, and even a better person by all accounts. I mean, there's a reason why such great awards carry his namesake. He coached a lot of the greats in terms of our game. Now here's Duncan. Gaines dishes to Lee. For the tie. They can't get that one to fall. The Bruins leading by three. You know, sometimes you can see how a player can lead on the floor from the sidelines, and you see that with Freak. I mean, he's got the skills and athleticism as a point guard in addition to the leadership, too. And, guys, people often underestimate just how important leadership is. You know, there's no stat for that. But guys like Chris Paul and Steph Curry have incredible skill, but their leadership on the floor is equally as important. Freak is a floor general in their mold. Now here's what UCLA is going with on the floor. Irving's checked in for Looney. Morris comes in for Campbell. And Freeze subbed in for Fresh. Now here's Williams. Yeah, that's a tough call right there, and, and really a tough break for the deep. Greg, no problem for me with that call. I mean, he was still sliding right there. Johnson, he's checked in for UCLA. Boss, he's checked in for the Jayhawks. Jenkins comes in for Williams. Now here's Jenkins, free defending. Just five on the clock. 
It's deflected. Irving with the steal. And here we go with Morris running it up the court. And the basket by Free. Now it's a seven-point Bruin lead. Three straight hoops in transition now. They'll want to end that trend in a hurry. Yeah, no excuse for giving up the easy, fast break baskets like they have. They've got to do a better job of engaging there. Daniels with it, covered by Morris. Daniels passes to Dedman. And he banks in the layup. Really, the defense is helpless to stop a layup right there. Just too much of an advantage in terms of the mismatch. Here's Free. He kicks the Freak. And he uses the glass on the way. Freak's got the lead up to seven now for the Bruins. Just reliable, guys. He's just always trying to make the right play. One thing with Freak that we know is he makes sure he gets his shots up no matter what. One way or another, he's going to get his workout in, and that's why so many are confident that he'll continue to improve. Part of it is that he, he has a twin sister who actually taught him how to play ball. <laughs> she helped him develop his game and become the player he is today. P pretty nice to have a sibling willing to help you develop your skill set on the court. Freak in a two guard. Irving is out there with Johnson. Then there's Free, and it's Morris in at the three. And now a new group getting ready to come in for the Bruins. On. Looney comes in for Irving. Campbell is checked in for Morris and Fresh subbed in for Free. Here's Looney. Count the bucket coming off a perfectly placed assist. That's the 10th straight point they've given up in the paint. And you know, it doesn't matter how good your defense is on the perimeter if you're going to allow easy ones inside like that. Lee kicks it to Gaines. Fresh pulls it in. The Bruins leading by six. Out to the right wing. 153 left to play here in the second half. There's the pick. There's Freak. They get it back. And no excuse there for missing that one after being freed up by a great pick. Yeah, I agree with you. I mean, they came away empty, but they got the look they wanted. And really, I, I've enjoy, I like the movement and communication there. The offensive rebound. Game. And that's good. A nice job in the glass as they pick up two on the second effort. And that put back about as easy a bucket as you're going to get. Exactly what happens when you don't box out, Greg. It's Freak, top of the key. Makes it off the glass. And UCLA leads by six. And with Freak, he takes a lot of pride in where he hails from. Didn't grow up with a silver spoon in his hand by any means. And his family cheers him on from Harlem. And Greg, you can see it in this game. I mean, we're all a product of where we've been, our environment, our experiences. And with Freak, he doesn't take anything for granted. Some of the very best players of all time have come from the projects like Freak. And he takes pride in playing for Harlem when he's on the court. He's giving them little to nothing at the offensive end. I can't put it any other way. The pass to Fresh. Here's Looney. To the left side wing. Freak passes to Campbell. Some nice ball movement by the Bruins. Freak with it. He's picked up by Lee. Here's Freak. Hits the front of the rim and out. And the Jayhawks with possession. Six-point game. Lee kicks to Duncan. His first shot coming late. Nails it! And now they trail by just four. And they commit an intentional foul. We'll see another one of those so they can get into the penalty. That's right. No other option but to foul and hope for some misses. Yeah, they have to extend the game. I mean, plain and simple. Use every second you can on the clock here. There's 10 seconds left in the second half. And now they decide to foul intentionally.
Here's Fresh. And he commits the intentional foul. And so the first one is good. He'll stay at the line for one more try. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's a six-point ball game. Those free throws are the nail in the coffin, guys. Now here's Lee. It's Terry outside. Misses. So it's UCLA picking up the win. It was a fantastic ball game, and they did a great job making sure it didn't get away from them late. Yeah, and they got pushed down the stretch, but they did what they needed to do and held their ground when it mattered most. They got the double. For Craig Anthony, Clark Kellogg, and the rest of our terrific 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. Man, what a game that was. We had fun with that game, but now it's time to go home. Sorry, sorry. Excuse me. Don't mind me. Let's go. Finally home. Now it's time to once again. <clears throat> now it's time to once again hit the sack because we have another big game tomorrow. <laughs> 